If there is one thing that I'm actively trying to escape from on this channel, it's the label of being a one-trick pony. But this label is a dangerous one as it means that you're only good at one thing only and nothing else. And for me, that's just not an option. Uh, because if you have seen my content, you know I'm trying hard to become the full package. Trying to get better at photography, filmmaking, all sorts of B-roll, product reviews of things that I really enjoy using, tips and tutorials, and occasionally a vlog here and there. And recently I also started flying FPV, which is one of my biggest challenges yet. And although I know it's not something that all of you guys would be interested watching on this channel, I will be putting out content that involves FPV because it's something that I really enjoy. It's something that I love doing. And if you want to watch something like this, then this video would be great for you. And that is because I have a new one. I just built a new racing FPV drone and I want to test it out and show you a few things about it. So here it is, this is the drone and as you can see compared to my other 5 inch freestyle quadcopter this one is a lot smaller, it's a lot lighter and it's a lot faster as well. It's using the Transtech HD laser uh, frame which you can find on DJI's official website. It also uses the T-Motor F4 stack also available on DJI's website, I will link it in the description. And I'm also using some Xnova racing motors, which are going to make this extremely fast compared to my regular uh, freestyle quadcopter. So uh, I'm really excited to try this out. I've only flew with this for five batteries in total, so it's still brand new to me. So this drone, I wanted to build it myself. I didn't want to buy a pre-built configuration. I wanted to get dirty and uh, learn how to build myself. And I did that with the help of my good friend, Danny, who is just 14 years old. And he helped me quite a lot with some questions which I had and with some soldering advice and some soldering as well. So thanks to Danny for helping me with that. And I'll link his channel, or should I say his Instagram in the description. He's just 14 and he has a lot of talent. So make sure you follow him as a thank you. The purpose of building this drone is because I want to get better at flying FPV. I want to have quicker reactions and I want to be able to uh, make some crazy maneuvers and with this drone hopefully I will develop my skills even more so uh, since I'm on this huge field there is nothing better to do than to test it out and uh, see how it's able to compare against my regular 5 inch quadcopter and I'm not going to strap a GoPro on this because it's still quite new and I'm not really sure in my skills as of right now. So I'm just going to use the DJI camera and show you what I'm able to create with it. Let's go.
that was fun and hopefully you guys enjoyed watching a little bit of my training session with the Transtech Laser HD uh, which is quite nice and I would say it's so ridiculously fast compared to my um, freestyle quadcopter and especially compared to any other drone being the Mavic Mini or the Mavic Air, Mavic 2 Pro, anything else is just so so different compared to this. Uh, and I'm really happy that I have this one so I can practice with it. Hopefully uh, the frame will be durable and it, it will withstand some crashes because uh, currently I still haven't crashed, believe it or not. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm having tons of fun and uh, even though I only showed you some uh, clips from the air unit, hopefully you guys will be okay with that because I just don't want to risk my GoPro and putting it on uh, this tiny little frame at least not yet I will I will probably do that at some point but for now I just wanted to practice take you along with me and show you what I am doing with my racing quadcopter do I really plan to race with this probably not I just want to get better at flying get better control and uh, with this thing I'm sure I'll be able to as it's so 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 ridiculously fast so hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this video Please let me know in the comment section below if you did smash that like button if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one or let me know what kind of videos you want to see me do next. And I'll see you very very soon in my next one. Ciao!